Okay, I can't find the question, but somewhere back there, I think when I did the chakra video, and I really tried to avoid messing with people's lives, but uh, I think when I did the chakra, I was talking about the high heart, and somebody asked me where the high heart was. Now, listen, to me it's a high heart, because it is the heart is in the middle of your chest right here, and this energy, to me, feels like it's right here. Let me turn this. Like right here. Like That's what it feels like to me. Um, but this is where I centralize that energy to come into this skin suit. It's where it happened to me. Um, I am not of the belief that everyone is the same and everything works the same for everybody. That is, to me, stupid. We are each creator gods. We are creating individually for our own reasons. So, to me, that's where the chakras all collapse into, was that place right above, outside of my real heart. But that may be simply, I haven't looked at everybody on the planet. I just haven't thought about it. Um, for everybody who's collapsed their chakras, I could do a scan and I could see where they are, but what's the point you need to find out where yours is and if you still have chakras and you know that they're there and i have had a really really bad childhood with some really really bad uh, trauma so my root chakra tends to pop out of that high high heart um consolidation and it does it frequently i can get triggered and man it'll separate and drop down uh so wicked fast and I have to work to pull it back in. So just because you've got something done, guys, doesn't mean it's going to stay that way. If you've collapsed all your chakras and you've been working with them for years, they can separate in, in an instant. Remember, go back to my now video. Uh, you recreate everything in the now every time. So if you go back to that thinking of chakras, just because you've collapsed them, unless you absolutely believe with everything in you that they will never break apart and go back to the chakra system, they are probably going to do so and you're going to have to pull them back um i really didn't know much about chakras till after i died and then i made the mistake of watching a few videos and bam they were created they were i didn't have them before i watched those videos but that's how powerful i was right after i uh came back after dying and i was pretty darn powerful at that point i just didn't have any idea how to control it at all so when i collapsed my chakras that's where it went for me. And I had heard somebody talk about high heart, so I just regurgitated the same word because it made sense to me. That's where mine went, was. But yours may be somebody, someplace different. Um, I was a nurse for 25 years and way into caring. It would make sense that mine would be close to my heart, which to me signifies caring and loving. Now, is a human heart have anything to do with actual loving and caring of course not but that's our society and that's kind of where i felt it and that's where it went if you're more of a thinker could it be around your head yeah i suppose it could it will not be through a crown chakra though it might consolidate above your head and be in the area that one person might think of as being a crown chakra but you cannot call it a crown chakra because that's separate from all of them that's a different chakra right so i would not call it a crown chakra and let i would come up with a different word if yours is above your head and you know it's the collapsed collapsing of all of your chakras and you're very intellectual and it's ended up being you know up here for goodness sakes do not call it a crown chakra because the crown chakra has already been those words have already been given energy as a separate part of that separate chakra system so it will not do you any it will not help you um in what you're doing it'll make it more difficult so name it something else come up with anything whatever you want to call it you can call it um if you're uh really into god that collapsed energy that connects you to uh the other side through the sun central sun and source that could be anywhere around your body it, it really can it's up to you wherever you put it uh, you're the god you decide there's not rules that say okay these chakras are 
here, here, and here, and they collapse and they go to the high heart. There is no such thing. I did that. I did that. There's no rule to collapse, to make those chakras. We did that in order to deal with um, how this whole system runs. That's a part of the game. All right. Does that make sense to everybody? Hope say. So. Uh, listen, if I've missed one of your questions, please, it, could you just re-comment again? Um, because I try to answer everyone's questions completely. Um, it's very important to me for me to answer your questions. So if you guys, if I miss somebody, um, please ask again. And I, I will get to you. And I apologize if I've missed your question. Uh, thank you so much for your support. I really, really appreciate it. Um, you guys are so nice. Really, you're so sweet. I appreciate everything that you, you're so sweet about your PayPal and your Patreon, and I really don't know what I'm doing. There's nothing finessing about my videos. And just to let you guys know, I don't watch my videos after I do them. I have no idea what I've said. I answer questions with what comes to me from the other side. I'll be out doing something, and I'll get like this. It's kind of like an artist gets something in their head, and they have to like write a song or write a poem or or uh, do a painting. That's how it gets in my head. I get an idea and it's there and it drives me crazy until I pick up the phone and talk about it. So there's something that like gets triggered and it gets sent in my head and I do a video. And I put the video up and I never look at it again. So I have really no idea. Um, please ask the questions in full uh, rather than relate it to the video, whatever I've said in the video specifically. So that I know what you're talking about. If you just give me a complete question, then I know what you're talking about. You guys are really good at that. But I just wanted to let you know that I have no idea what's on those videos. Because I just, you know, there's a lot of them. And I just don't do things that way. I just uh, do the videos, put them up, and let them go out where they're supposed to go. And whoever's supposed to hear them will hear them. And I trust in that. And that's the best that I can do. I trust that they'll find me. You guys will find me when, me when you need me. You'll find the video that you need when you need it. All right? Thanks a lot again for everything. I love you guys so much. Huge hugs, and I'll talk to you later. Bye now.